for a solo backpacking trip. Oh man. Ooh, came the wrong way. This is gonna be tricky. Good growth. Mm. Action sounds really good. 40 pound pack. There we go. All right, we are finally on our way. And of course, then I realize, gotta stop at gas. Not quite on our way yet. Hopefully not setting the tent up in the dark. Now we are finally on our way. Hey Siri, what time does the sun set today in Grantsville, Utah? Sunset will be at 8.49 p.m. All right, 8.49, we should get to the trailhead at 6. Got 3.7 miles to go. I don't think it'll take us more than two hours. So we should be okay. If we need to, we will just sleep in the truck and get started tomorrow. But I think we got this. Lock the car. feet in the dirt. Making our way up the trail. Feels nice. It's a perfect evening. It's a little cool. I think that our legs are going to be a little sore tomorrow because we are in for some climbing on this first leg. I think it's about 2,500 feet in 3.7 miles. So put our mount already warmed up. Put this long sleeve on because I was cool and I'm warm. Should have known. Let's get to it. texted me because we're planning a backpack trip for July. He just said, hey, so it sounds like the ticks and the rattlesnakes in Utah are extra bad this year. So maybe you don't want to go in July. We'll see what happens. I'm still planning on going, but man, for whatever reason, that just really kind of got me <laughs> freaking out about ticks and rattlesnakes. I know they're pretty common here and I've seen them. Snake but, right there. I don't know, for some reason, maybe just because it's my for a solo backpacking trip and also worried about the dogs diving into some bush, getting bit by a snake. Then I gotta carry a 50 pound husky out of here. Anyway, got me thinking about it a lot. And then of course, on the drive here, I kept picturing that scene from Indiana Jones where he falls in that cave with just like thousands of snakes. Ugh. So anyway, I'm loving that this trail is Nice and wide. Right now, I know we'll be fine, but still gets in your head sometimes. Wasn't gonna let that keep me from getting out here and enjoying the mountains. Clearly we're going up, so I'm a lot of breath. All right, back to it.
to our section here. All right, Gerties, we're more than halfway there. Let's stop for a water break up here. Here you go, Gerties. Oh, man. Oh, that must be because we're at peak. Yeah, we're not going up there. Nope. feeling all 40 pounds of that 40 pound pack but it was gorgeous over here We should have to cross that. Come on. And we're back on track. tonight to stay warm. All right girls, let's go this way. Come on. One of the comments on all trails said that the best tent spots were over here to this side. So that's what we're looking for. Oh man, we were really frozen. <laughs> we have to go back to the other side just to get water. I wonder if that's supposed to be the good tent spot. See what we find. Obviously somebody camped right there. That's not gonna work for us. This is going to be tricky. No, they're not set up camp right down there by the water. Be our only option. I'm going to run that bay right there.
All right, we got the tent set up. We are not gonna be doing anything else tonight. We are just getting some much needed calories. Hey, Yeah. Hey, Huh? Hope you go eat a little bit and then take a little bit of a nap. Actually, it's nine o'clock. We're gonna be going to bed soon. And here's mine, birthday cake. It's actually my son's birthday on Friday. I'd maybe save this for him, but uh, I want to eat it now. I'm hungry. Oh, the spot seemed sort of flat and smooth and soft, but now that I'm sitting on it, I don't think it's any of those things. But this is the best spot we could get, so I'll make it work. Good girls. Nine o'clock. It is. I'm surprised at how bright it still is outside. It's finally getting a little dark. It's about 9:30. The girlies are chomping on their bully sticks. All right, gonna cool down with a little reading. My feet are sore, but oh, I am paid for all my toil a thousand times over. I couldn't agree more. Time to take the girlies out. Really testing out that uh, gear hammock. Hi, ghoulies. Should we go out and go potty? We can go to bed. We are going to go to bed. It was a good day. We're gonna get some sleep now, hopefully. We'll uh, see you in the morning. Okay, yeah. Uh, what time is it? 7.17. Good girls. Get out in just a sec, okay? Let me get ready. Oh, got pretty cold last night. Clear reasons I'm wearing my puppy coat in here. But we stayed pretty warm in here. Brought two 50 pound heaters with me. The first time I woke up, I thought that I might have literally slept all the way till morning because the moon was so bright. It was like the sun was coming up. I definitely did not sleep all the way till morning. It was like 11.15. Bit of a rough sleep in our not flat camping spot. But okay, never a bad day backpacking. The two pillows, eh. Wasn't as awesome as I'd hoped. All right, I better go. You guys want to play, huh? We are finally ready to go. Whew, good thing too. This place was a pretty place to camp. Hey ladies, should we go? Alright, on our way out, that was a beautiful place to camp. And it worked out okay. Didn't sleep great, but I don't mind. Would have been nice if this spot wasn't covered in snow. So we've got about the same mileage today, but not nearly the elevation. Yeah, that must be the trail. Before we go too far, we are gonna fill up the water over here. Running low, so it will fill up. Message sent. Dog's gonna pull me down this hill, so better focus. This looks like a good spot. <sighs> Ooh, ice cold. Oh, so good though. All right, I'm gonna get a little more. Thank you. 
actually all downhill which I'm glad for man my legs are feeling it but tiny climb then all downhill Yesterday was just so rushed. I'm trying to make sure we got up the camping spot in time to set up. This is nice. Just a walk in the woods now. I love aspen trees. <laughs> Loving this trail right now. It's just so peaceful. Yesterday it was this super wide rocky road. This is just nice single track, tons of flowers. You can hear the birds. Yeah, loving this trail. too many shots of the wildflowers in here, but I don't know what to tell you. They're amazing. The mountain's just covered in them. Well, we are back to the rocky roads. Oh. Ice cream sounds really good. I don't even like Rocky Road. Some other kind of ice cream though. Yeah, this is not as enjoyable as the single track bursting with wildflowers on either side, but we'll take it. Well, this is about where we had planned to camp, and that's what we're gonna do. It looks like heaven compared to where we set the tent up last night. This is perfect. Well, girly, let's get you a nap, huh? Don't even have to heat it up. Damn. What the? Got him. Love this long-handled spoon. I'm actually gonna save. Whoa! I'm actually gonna save this bag for tomorrow to cook my oatmeal in. Then I'll have to get my pot dirty. Good plan. Blueberry. That was good. Girls were having a hard time relaxing just outside. It's like sensory overload. So set up the tent and hopefully they'll both take a good nap now. 
Is it you? Is it me? I might take a nap too. Or I'll start reading and then I'll take a nap. Yeah, that's a good plan. Anywho, so I have some nice long maps. Nothing I really like about backpacking with these new is that they need to get their rest in during the day. And that really just gives me time to relax. Now we're going to find some water. Let's go this way. There we go. And we are back in the tent. That road was super exposed and warm, so I gotta cool down a little, huh, Looney? Black fur, even you. Yeah. So, we are honestly gonna rest in here until probably 8.30, hang out, and then we'll go to bed. It's been a good day, though. All right, more relaxing. relaxing day. I can't remember the last time I had a day like this. Basically doing nothing other than a flat half mile hike, I guess. I'm loving it. last night. Doggo slept good. We're gonna get a slightly earlier start than yesterday. It was 6.20 right now. But we're all up. Why not? It's Austin's birthday. Might as well get home. Happy birthday, buddy. Let's go. Alright, we got camp all packed up. You didn't even finish your breakfast. You didn't get mine. And I'm gonna eat and then we're gonna head off. Mmm. That's good. Looking forward to getting home. I love these trips to get away from things. And then by the end, I'm ready to go back home. It's perfect. All right, well, see you on the trail. Just because this uphill is killing me. Day three, 40 pound pack. But it's all right, check us out. I said this morning before we started our hike that I was ready to go home. But as I see us slowly moving towards the car on the map, there's definitely a piece of me that wants to stay out here. I think there's definitely a bigger piece of me that wants to go home. But there's just something about being out here. Beauty and the peace and the self-sufficiency, the quiet. Really love it out here. <laughs> 